In a world where all is not as it seems, Gabriel was an adventurous 11-year-old boy who loved exploring new places with his friends. One day, they heard about an abandoned mansion on the outskirts of town. The mansion was rumored to be haunted by a mysterious figure, and Gabriel and his friends couldn't resist the urge to explore it. Little did they know that their adventure would lead them to a strange encounter with a kangaroo named Josiah. Gabriel and his friends arrived at the mansion on a sunny afternoon. The mansion was old and decrepit, with vines growing on the walls and broken windows. The group stood outside, looking up at the towering structure. Gabriel shivered, feeling a sense of foreboding. The group entered the mansion, and the air was thick with dust. They explored the first floor, finding old furniture and cobwebs. As they climbed the stairs to the second floor, they stumbled upon a strange room filled with old artifacts. There were old books, paintings, and even a stuffed kangaroo. Gabriel picked up an old book and began to flip through its pages. Suddenly, a small piece of paper fell out. Gabriel picked it up and read the strange note written on it. Beware the kangaroo, it read. Gabriel felt a chill run down his spine. As the group continued to explore the mansion, they heard strange noises coming from upstairs. It sounded like someone was walking around, but they couldn't see anyone. Gabriel and his friends cautiously climbed the stairs, their hearts pounding with fear. As they reached the top of the stairs, Gabriel and his friends saw a kangaroo standing in the hallway. The kangaroo was wearing a top hat and holding a cane. Gabriel and his friends were stunned. The kangaroo spoke in a deep voice, Welcome to my home. I am Josiah. Josiah explained that he used to be a performer in a traveling circus. He had been mistreated by the circus owner and had escaped to the mansion. He had been living there ever since, haunting the mansion to keep people away. He didn't want anyone to disturb his peaceful existence. Gabriel and his friends felt sorry for Josiah and convinced him to leave the mansion and start a new life. They promised to help him find a new home and a new purpose in life. Josiah was hesitant at first, but he eventually agreed. Gabriel and his friends helped Josiah find a new home in a nearby wildlife sanctuary. Josiah was happy to be surrounded by other animals and to have a new purpose in life. He became a mentor to the younger animals, teaching them how to survive in the wild. As Gabriel and his friends left the sanctuary, they felt a sense of accomplishment. They had helped Josiah find a new home and a new purpose in life. They had also learned that sometimes, things are not always as they seem, and that even a haunted mansion can hold a heartwarming surprise.